thank you guys so much for for coming on today and i was really looking forward to this i haven't talked to any of you guys since what 1995 it's been a while great. but yeah that's scary okay well let's just yeah. start because i'm going to ask you guys what everybody's doing too um so first i just want everybody to introduce themselves we have will binder dean erickson and peter lucas go ahead will Hi, I'm Will, um, and I am the director from Gabriel Night 2. I live in Los Angeles still, and uh, still pursuing directing, writing, and my artwork. And it's great to uh, to catch up with you guys. It's uh, I thought this was one of my best experiences was this was this game. I really really had a great time. Well, that's good. Yeah. Dean. Yeah. Yeah, this is Dean Erickson. I played Gabriel Knight, and um, I live in Los Angeles as well. I no longer uh, act, but I, I write uh, books, and I primarily run an investment business, uh, which I had done initially when I got out of college, so I've gone back to that. And uh, I'm married and enjoying life, and uh, all is good. But, yes, I also have very fond memories of our, our times with Gabriel Knight and uh, the, the shoot. Will, is that you? <laughs> no, no, it's not. Was it the, heavy, the heavy breathing, you mean? <laughs> Peter said it was the middle of the night, so he must have oh, tripped okay. over something. <laughs> no, I didn't. I, I'm sitting in front of the computer. Okay, okay uh, Peter, why don't you introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Peter Lucas. I played uh, Baron von Glauer. Um, Recently, I moved back to Poland, so uh, uh, forgive me my English. It's not as, uh, as as smooth as it used to be. Um, now I'm raising uh, my little two sons here in Poland, uh, still acting um, here and uh, partially in America. And uh, yeah, I have uh, not only great memories from shooting the show, but also uh, responses which we got with the game uh, afterwards. Uh, from all over the world. Yeah, I want to ask you guys about that. Um, yeah, everybody first... loved Peter. Why didn't anybody like me? Everybody <laughs> loved Peter. <laughs> oh, Peter's so handsome. Peter's this. Peter's that. No, it wasn't <laughs> that. But, but you know, it was, it was the nicest compliment I was getting that they felt sorry to, uh, they didn't want to finish the game because they had to kill me. <laughs> Uh, that was the nicest thing I, I, I remember getting from fans. And, and I was amazed that this game was actually released in so many languages because I was getting uh, fan mail, uh, probably you, you too, Dean, uh, from all over the world, Asia, South America, Europe. Uh, um, so uh, that was an incredible experience. Yeah, I have more Facebook friends from Europe than I do anywhere else you know, from, from, from the Gabriel Knight game. So it is fun. I, I think it's still the most isn't it the most uh, most popular most fan favorite uh, um, adventure game of all time pretty much Jane you know it was it was way up there I mean PC Gamer had a poll in the back of the magazine which was like the Reader's Choice poll and mm -hmm. um, it was like the number one slot for years but uh, yeah let's it's... let's claim it anyway <laughs> <laughs> yeah let's, let's say that it was I mean if it's not it's very close. Who's going to prove different now, right? <laughs> well, I've certainly gotten lots of fan feedback on both you guys, Dean and Peter, and, you know, people demanding to know when you're going to be in another game of mine, and, you know, you have to use Dean, you have to use Peter. And I, I do hear a lot, too, people say, you know, it was the one thing they didn't like about GK2 was that Von Glauer had to die at the end. Yeah, well. <laughs> well, you know, it's tragedy. I don't know. It's you can always find a way to bring him back. That's eh? right. Hey, Dallas, well, did it? Come actually, on, it's all a dream I, I, sequence. Actually, I did a show uh, called uh, um, Seven Days when I uh, I died there three times. Uh, <laughs> no, it's it's not funny. In the pilot, in the pilot, I died twice because there was a travel. Uh, you know, we were we were traveling back. So first, I actually, being a, 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 um, a member of a Chechen uh, team, I, I uh, blew up myself after I, I accomplished the mission. And then I was uh, um, uh, killed in front of the White House. But the producers wanted to uh, 
uh, bring me back uh, in appreciation that the show was picked up. So two years later, they brought me back as my brother. Okay. And I was, and I was killed again. There you yeah. go. That's a okay. good idea. <laughs> Everything is possible. Well, Dean, you died a lot in GK2 as well. It just wasn't permanent. Oh, well. Uh-huh. Didn't you die? Didn't, there were yeah. places in the game where you could die. Hey, are you talking about my acting? <laughs> <laughs> no, w- yeah. wasn't there a but section in the woods when you were yeah. you were in the woods where you could get uh, killed and die? And well, yeah, we had all those shots of you with, with your neck bleeding. Remember, torn yeah. open. Uh, yeah. wolf, they made a mistake. Wolf. The wolf. <laughs> well, how did you get involved with GK Two? How did I get involved? Originally, I came. I was going to be involved um, with a, a classmate of mine, Mark Miermont from UCLA Film School. Um, actually, lined up the job. Uh, is directing the video game GK2, and I was going to come on as his production manager. Um, and in the pre-production, it didn't really work out with Mark, so he was he was no longer on the project. And I and I uh, went in there with my background and 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 uh, and, and uh, continued the pre-production and and then directed the uh, the game. Um, so that's how I got in with a friend of mine and then brought the rest of the crew or a lot of the rest of the crew up. And we, we when Mark was there, we didn't even cast yet. We only had a couple um, people cast. Um, and then we did the rest of the casting and uh, and that's how I got in, involved. Um, Ian, yeah. how, how did you uh, hear about this role and how did you get cast in it? Back in the day, when I had an agent, uh, they they let me know about this and uh, called me in on it. I guess Dan Parada was the casting yeah, director, and uh, uh, so I went in and met with Dan. And uh, I don't know if I think Will might have been there the first yeah, go around too. Yeah, and uh, so we did a did a scene or a cold read on camera, as I recall, and uh, just a usual casting session. I well. still, yeah, I still remember Jane. You remember this when he, when Dean was inside. I think it was at the uh, he came up you, when you yeah. met him, mm-hmm. and then he gave uh, he was doing some lines, and I can't remember which lines they were, but he really scared scared you, and that's when you you were sold on Dean completely. You remember that? Yeah, I think we had picked a couple different scenes for him to read, and and one was just sort of normal stuff, and then I think we maybe had him read some. Remember the scene at the very end where you're screaming at Grace? <laughs> that was it. Yep. And. Uh, yeah, I like that. So, <laughs> Phew, I, I was, I was plenty boring for the first two scenes. Because I remember the hair, the hair, the hair, the hair. Yeah, was I, remember the hair. I, I, I had longer I, hair, just like you and, and Jane. Originally, you saw a person with shorter hair originally, but after that scene, it was like the hair didn't matter. It was all good, you know. Dean was the guy. Yeah. Well, frankly, Will, I was always known as a hair actor, and I think, <laughs> and I, think I proved that during the shoot and <laughs> through the game that I, I do a lot of acting with my hair. Well, you did have to cut your hair because your hair was quite long before that, wasn't it? Yeah, oh, that's true. I probably had a ponytail beforehand. Yeah. Uh-huh. Wow, you still haven't paid me for cutting my hair. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You've been paid but, I think, but I think the, the casting process was kind of long because I remember uh, after I auditioned, I haven't heard uh, um, for a while from from the production, and probably like months or six weeks later, I was called back. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. That was the whole transition between Miramont and myself. It all everything kind of stopped for a little while there. Oh and I then, see. Okay. And then I came back on, we didn't, and uh, and we finalized the casting, and um, and then started production. Well, I, I think too, we didn't really need Von Glauer right away. <laughs> right. You know, in terms of we, were, we, were, we, we did a lot. Of, we did a lot of shooting just with Dean by himself. Was right, well, because of all the yeah. just little like you know, walk across the floor, pick up something, open a door, and sure, sure, and sure, with, yeah, Dean, with Joanne too. Exactly, Dean was probably the most. She was most you know on camera, and, and then Joanne. But um, but I still things got delayed a little bit there at the beginning because um, of some of the uh, some of the um, the crew, the situation with the crew and myself. Right. Uh, and then okay. we got up to speed went. They actually uh, um, auditioned you, Peter, long before they did me, and they figured once they had you, they were good to go. Then they had to, <laughs> you know, you, you, you were just, they already cast you, so you were just waiting for me to come along, I guess. 
Right. But you know, <laughs> uh, actually, what I was amazed uh, that just only my sides were 100 pages. I mean, the script, the script itself was 100, uh, 700 pages long. Uh, am I right, was it, Jane? I was the thinking script, it was more like 1,000. Was, yeah. was, it, was it 700? The Jeez, script that ate Hollywood. It was amazing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was n never – no one shoots that much. We were shooting sometimes 15. Yeah, I think the uh, most we did it on a day was like 18 pages to 20 pages in a day, which is, you know, unheard of. Um we were just zipping through it, but that's, you know, that's the scope of it, you know. Yeah, but, I remember uh, my, 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 that was the toughest scene for me, that a scene where we were just sitting, uh, uh, Dean, and, and talking in my, in my uh, quarters, and there was so much talking, and I remember I had like 25, <laughs> 25 pages to remember. <laughs> English is my second language. I was just only like five years or six years in America, you know, and it, it was hard for me to, to re learn, but because I knew it's going to be shot in, in, in one day, I really uh, took my time before learning, learning those lies because it, it would be very hard. But uh, I don't know how about you, Dean, or, um, because when I got the game, I couldn't wait to play it. But actually, even I read the script, uh, so I, 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 at, at, at this point I really uh, uh, have to bow to all the players who were able to finish the game without help. At the time, there was this uh, uh, service called CompuServe, and on CompuServe I was able to find tips and be able to find the game, uh, finish the game, because I, I, couldn't, I couldn't go from one scene to another. I was just not very good at it. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm with you. I still haven't been able to play it. And uh, it's, it's funny, my wife wanted to see it, so we've tried to download it from uh, GOG.com, and, and it didn't work the first time. So I still have to uh, get a click through and, and try to get through it. So, well, you know, yeah, um, on YouTube, you can watch the whole thing if somebody's yeah. played through it. That's yeah, you true. Can, I have watched some of those. That's right. Yeah. Not the whole you, thing, but you know that Peter. Sorry. You can get you can just go onto YouTube and you can you know go you know Gabriel Knight two you know video or or you'll get all the scenes from the entire the entire piece you can you can you can you know download oh, wow. your computer. It, in case you have lots of extra time with your two sons. <laughs> right. right. <laughs> so, Will, did you play the game too, or no? I did, of course, of course, but I haven't played it in a long time. So, what did you guys think of it as a game? I mean, in terms of like, was it did it feel well, like it, that, the full it, motion it, video made sense to you in the game and that, you know, it all was cohesive? Uh, for me, it was a total breakthrough. Uh, um, I mean, I was amazed with uh, the options, with the quality. I finally started to understand, you know, how it was coming about. Uh, I, I was really impressed. Actually, I remember uh, my parents were uh, 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 at this point point visiting me in, in America and I wanted to show them that so I w uh, spent the whole night trying to find the ways how to get to my scenes of course <laughs> <laughs> and, show, and show them that but uh, it was it was amazing you know at the time I think it was p created for what Windows 98 um, yeah yeah, just, oh, yeah so it, uh, right now it wouldn't play probably on Windows 7 <laughs> but uh, because I have still, uh, some original copies um, but I was I was amazed with the, the idea and with the quality we were, we, we got. 